Hey there, this is Vlad Trichenko with Insurance Sales Lab. In this video, I'd like to go over a new team member training schedule that you can put your new hires through. I'm an insurance agency owner in Dallas, Texas. I've worked with thousands of agents over the last six years, and I've helped them hire and train their new staff. And one of the biggest pain points for agency owners is that initial phase of the first one or two months where you have to teach your new hire so much about selling, about quoting, about the product. And we've been trying to put a very simple and easy to follow training schedule that all agency owners could use when they hire new staff. And that is what we're going to go over here today. And this PDF that I'm showing you here on the screen, you can download, it'll be right below this video, and you can modify it and make it your own. But let's go through the 10 day schedule. Let's start off with day one and two. The first couple of days, what you wanna do is have the new hire complete the company required training to get binding authority. So every carrier has a version of that. Farmers calls it the activator course. You need to complete that in order to get binding authority. So you knock that out and then you go to the next step. So in this case, day three, you complete an exercise called insurance made simple. Now this is an exercise I created a while back because I found that a lot of new hires that start working in agencies have no idea on how insurance works. And I don't blame them because the pre-licensing course doesn't really go into depth on that. It just teaches you the legal talk, but it doesn't teach you the actual terms that you'll be using on a day-to-day -day basis. For instance, the difference between comprehensive and collision, a new hire must know what that is. The difference between uh, actual cash value or replacement costs on a homeowner's insurance policy, a team member must know what that is. So what we do with this exercise, as you can see here at the top, it's called insurance made simple. You give them this document and you have your team member spend one day and one day may seem like a lot, but it's necessary for the new hire to really grasp these concepts. And what they'll do is they'll go through all of these terms for auto insurance, all of these terms for home insurance, these general key terms, concepts around insurance, and they'll go on Google, they'll watch YouTube videos, they'll learn how to take these concepts and break them down in layman's terms, in practical English, so that uh, a teenager would be able to understand these terms. So what I like to do at the end of day three is sit down with the producer and have them go through each and every one of these key terms and explain it to me as though I'm 12 years old. And if I can't understand as a 12 year old, it's not good enough. So we ought to be able to explain these complex insurance terms in simple ways. So that's really the purpose of day three. So once that is completed, then we transition to day four. That's the internal, system, internal systems training where uh, you teach your new hire how your phone system works, how your CRM works, how you document notes. If you have a gift card platform, how that works, what lead vendors you buy leads from, you teach them how you do stuff in your particular agency. So that's the first four days. Day five and six, is where you now have the new hire prepare mock quotes. Even if you're hiring a CSR who's not going to be doing any selling, they should still learn how to prepare quotes. So what I like to do is have the new hire first prepare a quote on themselves and their friends, family members, just so they can understand how the whole process works from beginning to end. And then we can assign additional leads to that new hire. It could be old leads that we have in our database. And the goal here is to knock out 10 auto quotes, 10 renters, homeowners, and five umbrella quotes. And it could be on the same 10 people. You can have the same prospect, the same lead, get an auto quote, renters, homeowners, and umbrella quote. So once you have the quotes prepared, then you transition to the next step. But here's one quick note that I want to make, is that if you take a little bit of extra time during the first few quotes, that the new hire is preparing and you just teach them all the nuances and details, I encourage you to just back off, leave the room and let the producer, the new hire, prepare the quotes on their own. 
and really go from beginning to end with the remainder of the quotes. And then you can come back and verify everything. Okay, so once you're done with that, then you have to teach the new hire how to sell. That's what you do in day seven and eight. There's a couple of ways you can do that. You can either take time, two days, and spend with your new hire and teach them how to start a call, how to build value in the policy that you're going over so that they're not focusing on price. You teach them how to multi-line the other line of business, how to present the price, how to ask for the sale, how to overcome objections, how to set the onboarding appointments, how to ask for referrals. You can take the time out of your day to teach your new hire how to do that, or you can have our training platform do that for you. There's not a better training platform out there that can teach your new hires how to sell better than the One Call Close Masterclass, which you get with your Insurance Sales Lab membership. And one thing before I give you a quick 60 second overview of the One Call Close Masterclass, I want to make this point very clear that this is not just for new hires. If you have a team member in your agency who's crushing it, they're writing 40, 50, 60,000 a month in PNC premium, they too would benefit from going to the One Call Close Masterclass. What you see here on the screen, the One Call Close Masterclass, is a training that I built specifically for PNC insurance agents to teach them how to sell effectively and also generate referrals from the new business. So I'm not gonna go through all the lessons, but really when I, what, what I want to point out is how detailed this One Call Close Masterclass is, where we go through the hook, the hook objections, we go over how to build rapport, how to build value, everything you need to know about selling insurance is covered in here. Someone needs to teach your producers how to handle these objections that you see here on the screen, such as email me the quotes. Your price is too high. I need to talk it over with my spouse. It's either going to be you teaching your new hire how to do this and how to overcome these objections, or you can have the One Call Close Masterclass do that for you. Okay, so that's what you do during day seven and eight. It's complete the sales training, the One Call Close Masterclass. Day nine is where you put all of that together. You take the quotes that your producer already prepared and you combine it with this new sales process that your new hire just learned called a six step script to the one call close. And you go through six mock sales conversations. So I'm not gonna go through all of them individually, but I'll point out the first one here where you pretend that you're making an outbound call. You start off with auto insurance and then you transition to renter's insurance and you sell it as a bundle. And you do that by using, of course, the six step script of the one call close. And what I would encourage you to do is have your new hire record their screen. The way they can do that is they use a Chrome extension called Loom, L-O-O-M. It's a free Google Chrome extension where you can record your screen and speak into the computer and record a video. And then once the video is recorded, your new hire can just send you a link so you can watch that video. Here's an important note. I have seen this time and time again, that team members, new team members, want to impress you, their new boss, and make these videos perfect. What I always tell new hires is don't worry about perfection with these six videos. Just get them done in one day. Even if they're not perfect and you're stumbling through the videos, that's okay. All we want the new hire to learn is how to navigate the system while also using the six step script, the one call close. Hopefully this is making sense. We are now on day 10. This is the final certification. This right here is where the new hire has an opportunity to earn a 500 or a $1,000, really what, whatever number you wanna to attach to that, a sign on bonus. So here's how this works. What I tell every new hire on day one, when they first start, is in 10 days, on day 10, we're going to have a final certification. And if you can recite three steps verbatim from the six step script of the one call close, I'll give you a sign on bonus, 500 bucks or $1,000, different agencies do different things. So the first step is the hook. It's what you say in the beginning of the call. You have to be able to recite that step verbatim, no mistakes. And then you recite step four, which is cost presentation. Again, verbatim, no mistakes. Step five is asking for the sale. What do you think this will do if your new producer, new hire, learns these three steps? Well, on day 11, 
they can start calling real leads and start closing business right away. Because not only do they know how to quote and they know the, the lingo that they're going to use, but they also know how to sell. They know how to start the call, how to present the price and ask for the sale. So look, as an agency owner, you are a, a business owner. You're a 1099 contractor. You do whatever you want to do. No one can force you to do anything. But my advice to you, from a business owner to a business owner, from an agency owner to an agency owner, is that the 10 days, when you, the first 10 days of when you hire someone, those are the most critical days of bringing on new staff. And by following this 10 day schedule, you'll get your new hires up to speed. So with that all said, if you're a member of the Insurance Sales Lab training platform, start using this right away. If you're not yet a member of the Insurance Sales Lab training platform, then you can enroll in that today. Simply go to insurancesaleslab.com and you'll be directed to a website that looks similar to this. You can click get started and you'll be taken to our order form and within minutes, you can have access to the most powerful sales and referral training that exists in the insurance industry. You can just fill out this order form and get access right away. There's a lot of video testimonials that we have here on the website of what agents say about this platform. You can watch those if you'd like. With that, I hope you found this video to be helpful. If you'd like to download this PDF, you will find that right below this video. And as always, if you have any questions about anything that we've covered, you can ask them in the comment section below this video, and you can also email us directly. You can find that information on our website. Hope you have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.